Bus drivers in Ellington will get to work even earlier to make sure kids get to school on time. This all comes after buses were stalling in the cold weather yesterday, leading to some last minute cancellations and delays. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Caitlin Nuclo is live inside the warm early warning weather tracker 2 this morning where it's out there where things were chaotic for families, right Kate? Yeah, it sure was, and the school district is not happy about it. We're inside the weather tracker this morning because it's still so cold out, and we want to show you what we're seeing outside of our front window here because you can see the bus drivers are already here this morning warming up these buses to make sure that they don't have the same problem today. A spokesperson with First Student Bus Services says the extreme temperatures yesterday were a very unique weather event and diesel fuel is not very cooperative when it's that cold out, which is why the buses were struggling. But the district says the bus company had enough time to prepare. The situation left many kids stranded at bus stops in that bitter cold. A two hour delay turned into cancellations at elementary schools because the buses wouldn't work and it caused an even longer delay at the middle and high school. That last minute call cause some confusion for families. I just got done doing snow removal and I had to get my kids earlier this morning because they were supposed to go to school. And then uh, he went to his bus stop and it got canceled last minute. And as you can see, another live look at the bus yard here. Uh, we got here about 4 o'clock this morning, and these buses were already up and running uh, just to make sure that everything runs on schedule today. The bus company did apologize to the school district. Of course, you can always get delay and closing information on the Channel 3 app, and we'll keep following this story for you. We're live in Ellington, Caitlin Nuclo, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.